Hello everybody and welcome back to a new video on my YouTube channel. Today we're back with a new reaction and today we're here with the final teaser for G Idol's Last Dance music video. Um, We've reacted to Prologue to Witch Queen last Friday and we've reacted two days ago to the first music video teaser and both looked amazing. From the concept to the outfits to the peak of the instrumental we received on the first music video teaser, teaser A, now we're here with teaser B, uh, looked amazing. Like the outfits, uh, like the white dresses, the old school vibes, then this mystique witch theme in the forest, but um, in comparison, the very bright sounding uh, beat, uh, which may give away that this might be a, you know, a summer song, you know, like a bit more uh, joyful, uh, even though it looks a bit more dark. So this is very interesting. This seems like a very interesting combination. Soldier was in there too, despite the controversy. So a lot of questions are still that have yet to be answered. And let's see if this next teaser can give us more answers to these questions. Yeah, the last dance, official music video teaser B. Let's go. Again, with an intro in such a short video, but all right. Ooh, look at them. Oh my God, look at the close-ups. Oh yeah, this is going to be a dance instrumental, I guess. Ooh. Woo, did you hear that? Well, John John Last Dance. Okay, never mind. Maybe it's not an instrumental chorus after all. Maybe this is the opening to it. Okay, this sounds very, very... Once again, we uh, got um, the same um, instrumental part again. And like I said, it sounds very bright. The concept and the look looks more dark toned. But the song fitting for Groovy Room sounds like a, like, like a bob. Like a, like a, a fun themed dance track. So yeah, let's watch it again. Once again, a beautiful shot there with all of them. Zoe on the with that. Oh my lord, their outfits are amazing. And then here these close-ups. Look at Zoe on! Look at Mini, Shua, Yuki, everyone! But here Sojin is not included, I think. Yeah, I think. Chong Me Last Dance. This sounds already good! This sounds already really good! Obviously, can't, can't speak Korean, but Chong Me Last Dance! That's very energetic, I like that. And now let's let's pause it some moments here. We had that in the first one already. Here, the little dance thingy. Zoyon looking absolutely insane. I've mentioned it before. If it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be here right now. She and KDA made me uh, check out K-pop as general. So everything Zoe just hits differently. Here, great part once again. This looks like a great location. And I guess um, now that we did see the close-up of Sojin here, um, they really try to like to cut those as um, like the part that only focus on her. But actually, you can't cut her out here. They would have had to redo the entire choreo, the entire uh, scene here. So I guess um, they just leave out the solo parts and um, remix it like, you know, give uh, the looks to someone else. But just keep this thing here. It would be too uh, difficult and too much um, extra to do that. Once again here, that looks fantastic. Zoe with the with the gray hair looks amazing with the silver. Now here, not these close-ups. Beyond looks fantastic, very mystique. Zoe, oh my lord! Oh my god! Zoe, come to what the hell? Look at them! I look at her. Oh my lord! The makeup, the hair, the look. Mini as well with the red, beautiful makeup. I love this little finger on the cheek. The crowns as well, they look so majestic, they look like absolute queens, beautiful. And here, a little peek of Yuki, don't skip away like that, what the hell, Yuki looks amazing, I love her short hair here recently, generally she looks amazing, like the uh, social media update as well, also with the white crown and white outfits, looks beautiful. Then here, this dance thingy, and then obviously Shuhua, our visual, looks beautiful as well, love the long hair. Makeup on point as well, red or a bit, you know, not not as much as the others, but works beautifully, love the molds. Yeah, that looks like a damn intense choreo. Then here's a mystique shot again. This is going to be a bop, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be insane, I can already tell it. 
The music video and the visuals look already absolutely incredible. High Giardo standards as usual who I was a whole movie. And um, now once again with insane outfits, insane concepts, insane look, hair, makeup, everything. And now the instrumental and this little peak of the chorus already sounds amazing. The Chomney Last Dance and Chomney Last Dance is already in my mind. I, I can already feel that this is going to be a loop track that you can just... You choose it on Spotify and press the button on the right bottom and just listen to it over and over. This is going to be great and I can't wait for this. But y'all, once again, where is it? Zoyan has to calm down, y'all. Zoyan really has to... <sighs> look at her. Unbelievable. They all look amazing. It's going to be a movie. And I hope I see you there tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick reaction to the second music video teaser and my little review and analysis to it. Um, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like down below. What are your thoughts on this teaser? Tell me down below. And if you enjoy what I'm doing, leave a sub as well. It would help me a lot. All right. Either I see you with a new reaction or I see you here tomorrow once again at the same time with G Idol Last Dance. I'm extremely excited for this and I hope you are too. Stay safe, healthy, and happy. And I hope to see you tomorrow.